Q&A Thursday. Hey Thursday, it's Thursday. That's right. This is where you ask the questions and I supply the answers. So our cue for today is from Kari, K-A-R-I, and Kari is from Ohio, up in the Midwest. She said, Dear Sharon, my big dream all my life was to be a model. Have I totally missed the boat? It is my time up. Oh, wow! What a great question, Kari. Just so happens I have the answer to you. Absolutely not. You haven't missed the boat. There is such a huge demand right now for models 40 and up. That's right. You think they're stuck, but there is a major demand for models and in the midlife years and the boomers especially and let me tell you kind of what it's going to take a little bit and then I'll give you some resources. First thing, I don't care who or what you are, anytime you need to be a model you have to be fit. Okay, I didn't say skinny, I said fit. For a model 40 plus years old, okay, they want you to be extremely fit. Um, let's say that you want to be a model doing commercial print. This is where you don't have to worry about the walk-in. Now, there's not any high fashion models that are middle-aged. Those are girls, you know, 13 to 25 years old. That's where the high fashion models come in. So, yay, we don't have to walk. But the commercial print and catalog type models need to be totally fit, have a great face, and have uh, everything in proportion, if you know what I mean. The majority of the models 40 plus are size 8. That is the most popular size models. There's also a fit model, meaning you can go into any designer and they just start pinning all the dresses and the outfits on you and you're standing all day long getting pinned. But now mind you, the fit models make as much as the big high fashion runway models. Keep that in mind. And those are in demand. Now, of course, what they're looking for and it's huge, huge industry right now, and a huge demand is the plus size model. So you can't be too short, but you need to be mm, somewhere in the vicinity of 5'8 and up, uh, possibly, but you need to have an hourglass figure. In other words, if your bust is 40, your waist needs to be 30, and your hips need to be 40. So everything is in between 10, 10, and 10, if you see what I mean. So you gotta have a great base, you gotta be just fit, and you kind of be ready to rock and roll. Now, do you need to spend an elaborate amount of money going in and getting all these professional pictures done first? No. Actually, they kind of want to see you in your bare minimum makeup, if you know what I mean. Polaroid shots are their favorites because you can't doctor those. Uh, but they do take some of the other digital photos. Um, there is a book that's written by an author. Her name is Judy Goss. Um, now, Judy had like over, um, she was a Ford model. She's had over 20 years in the modeling business. Um, she is now a booking agent and editor and all for More Magazine. So, she's a, she is a pro to go to. And as you well know, More Magazine caters to the women that are older. That's why you have such a hard problem when you're seeing all my blog entries and a lot of articles. I have to show all the outfits on younger models because you never see, you know, the more mature models. That's why I like more magazine because it's down our alley. It's like 40 and up. And she wrote a book and it's a great book and I want you gals to get it. You can go on Amazon.com. You know, I'll put a, a picture of what the book looks like on here. And it's called Breaking Into Modeling for under $20. And she's going to teach you what steps you take. She's going to teach you all about the, you know, the, the calls that you go to when you're, you know, cast calls. She's going to teach you the scams and the things to stay away from, exactly what you need to do, 40 plus. And keep one thing in mind, uh, she'll give you a list of agencies and everything in the book too, which I think are phenomenal. But she'll even tell you some talent agencies have a commercial print department that handles the commercial print models. So you've got different divisions of models that you can fit into. Now, a lot of my ladies say, well, Sharon, you know, I, I'm just about five feet or five two, and I'm, I'm pretty petite. Is there a market for that? Some areas, that's a little tougher market. Most of the women 40 and up 
need to be at least 5'4 and up, and you need to be fit, and you need to walk in with total confidence. That's the first thing they look for. They're not so much going to look at your pictures. I mean, they want you to have a decent face. You can't look like a dog, you understand. I mean, you got to have a great face. But what they're looking for is what they can do with you and how they can mold you and the kind of makeup they want to put on you and how they want to do your hair and so forth. So there is such a huge demand right now. I have about, I guess, 30 or 40 clients that are in the business. I have one that was a... Um, a big high fashion plus size model with Ford and of course now she's married to the Baron of Sweden and lives abroad and has retired so what does that tell you ladies but can you have a great income absolutely can you have a lot of travel and fun and excitement absolutely six figure income is what you have to look forward to when you're 40 plus and up so I'll put this information down here Grab this book. It's only eight to ten dollars. You can even buy it used on Amazon. Okay, it's easy to read. Judy has put in all the information. I'm going to try to do my best uh, to get her one night on a little teleseminar call and have an interview with her in case you want to ask her a lot of questions personally. So we'll do that. But thanks for your question, Kari, and you're never too old, girlfriend. So keep me posted. Read the book. Check it out. Get some. Get some friends, take some pictures of you, and then, you know, I want you to personally, you know, deliver the pictures. It's best not just to email or throw them out there, but in Judy Goss's book, she'll give you a lot of details. But like I said, get it now while it's so in demand. This is great. See, we can all be superstars no matter what size or what age. And let's say you want to be a model now, but you still have a few pounds to lose. That's okay, just lose a few. They're looking for primarily uh, for the standard fit model a size A. For the plus size model, all you, it starts at size 10 and goes up. Remember, if you have two digits in your dress size, you are a plus size then. And I say primarily that 10 is smaller, not as in demand, and it is from 12 on up to 3X. But you need the hourglass figure. You can't have a pear shape. You can't have like big boobs, skinny hips, or you know, you can't have no boobs and then you got this broad bum. Okay, you see what I'm saying? So you want to be fit, you want to be in shape, and you know, average it out. You want to have that hourglass figure to be a middle aged model. So good luck to you. Let me know if there's anything else I can help you with. And be sure to catch me on my YouTube now and subscribe and put your comments down there. I'd love to hear from you. If there are any other videos you want, any other information, shoot me an email. Talk to you later and have a good one.